the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, has condemned the Nigerian army for launching Operation Golden Dawn in the southeast region of the country. The group alleged that the operation was another scheme of the military men to embark on a killing spree of residents of the region similar to what was done with Python dance in which many lives were lost in 2017. According to IPOP, it is disgraceful that the military operatives leave northern Nigeria that has been ravaged with terrorism and banditry only to concentrate on the southeast and other southern regions. In a statement by Ima Pafu and obtained by Sarah Reporters on Wednesday, IPOP berated political leaders in the region for not speaking against the operation. The statement reads in part, This operation is another round of secret genocide akin to the infamous Python dance by the Nigerian army. This is another ploy by the military to continue directly killing of Igbo youth just because they want to have an independence. We wonder why a special military operation would be launched in the southeast, why the same military has overlooked away from Kaduna, Niger, and other northern states, which have become a slaughter ground by Fulani bandits and terrorists disseminating Christian communities almost unchallenged. The level of insecurity in southeast which of course was created by the same Nigerian security agencies, is a far cry to the states you know, of near Ainaki in the northern region. Why is it during special military operations that the Fulani controlled federal government remembers Southeast? But when it has to do with infrastructures and appointments, they'll go to the north. When we talk about, you know, Special military operation, that is when the Fulani controlled federal government will remember the Southeast. But when we talk about infrastructures, when we talk about appointments, they will never remember Southeast. It will rather go to the North. A message to the operatives deployed for this wicked special operation is to make sure that they don't kill any innocent Biafran or IPOP member. If they know where the bandits were created to wreak havoc in the southeast, let them face them. But any day they touch innocent Biafrans in the southeast, they will regret their action. They should be ashamed of themselves that even soldiers are being killed by Fulani bandits in the north, but they are here declaring a special operation in a relatively peaceful region. Repeat the southeast politicians and the political elite who lack understanding of the times. They are only after their political interest in 2023. Recall that the Nigerian army on Sunday announced special military exercises in the southeast, southwest and south-south region of the country, codenamed Golden Dawn, ensuring peace and still water. The army spokesperson Onyema Uwachuku on Sunday said, Farouk Yahaya, the chief of army staff, will perform the flag off in Enogon State. He had said the exercises, which were routine, were to stem the tide of criminality as the yell tide approaches. What is your thought about this? What is your own reaction to this present situation? We would like you to let us know your thoughts on this. We have had, according to the news, that the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, has condemned the Nigerian army for launching Operation Golden Dawn in the southeast region of the country. According to IPOB, it is disgraceful that the military operative leave northern Nigeria that has been ravaged with terrorism and banditry. We all know how the northern part of Nigeria is being ravaged with terrorism and banditry. We all know series of things that is happening there where the Boko Haram are practically taking over 
all their lands from them, taking away their farmlands from them, taking away all their businesses away from them, and yet still collecting taxes from them. And yet, the government of Nigeria, the Fulani controlled federal government, is still launching you know, security outfits in the south east and not in the northern part of nigeria while would you launch such you know operation going down in the southeast of the country why would you do that there well, whereas we have the northern part of nigeria that is being ravaged with terrorism and banditry why is it always in the southeast according to what has been said they want to use you know this ploy to start or probably continue their killing spree on on the residents of the region that's what the group have alleged that the operation was another scheme of the military men to embark on this killing spree of residents of the region similar to what was done you know by the python dance in which many lives were lost in 2017 what is your thought about this python dance have you know come and go they now you know come up with another operation called golden dawn we will not take it if golden dawn should make a mistake to shoot or kill any you know innocent biafran or southeast residents if they know where the hideouts of these terrorists are let them go there and storm there but if by mistake they'll hit any innocent biafrans then something will happen that is what has been said what is your reaction to this what is your thoughts about this we would like you to let us know your own point of view concerning this but before we go let's see people's reactions and know their thoughts about this let's see what people have felt concerning the present situation of things in nigeria kalu ima reacted to this and said boko haram terrorists attacked nda kidnapped and killed officers and yet nothing happened from the army if it were to be in the southeast they would have come to show themselves by killing innocent civilians if buhari likes he should declare operation oeu again what is written in heaven must be made manifest on earth biafra must come we have had words Kalu Emmanuel has said concerning the present situation of things that Boko Haram terrorists attacked the Nigerian Defense Academy, they kidnapped one and they killed two officers and yet nothing from the army. If this should have happened in the southeast, they would have come out to show themselves by killing innocent civilians. But according to Imai said, if Buhari likes, he should declare Operation OAU again. We don't want to know. In fact, we are not concerned. What is written in heaven must be made to manifest on earth, which is Buhari, you know, Biafra, pardon, must come. What is your thought about this? What is your own reaction to this plane development? We would like you to share your thoughts with us on this. Don't forget that I pop up tell Nigerian army that declare golden dawn operation in Niger. Cardinal states that are under bandit and terrorists leave the southeast where there is relatively peace go to the regions in the northern region like kaduna and ninja where the place is under bandits where the place is under terrorist attack go to those places to operate don't disturb the southeast that's what i probably tell nigerian army would like you to let us know your own thoughts on this thank you guys for listening do subscribe to this channel if you have not and i'll see you if on the other news bye for now